Hey. What's up? It's Festa time. It's super Festa time. It's extra Festa time. It's actually our second Festa time. Is, is it a bird? Is it a plane? It's Unpon Man. Man. <laughs> it's Unpon <laughs> Man. I like what you did there. That's okay. So, Peter, you mentioned that there. It's It's been a long time coming. One of the only songs that we haven't like individually reacted to on this channel is Unpon Man. Mm. And and I know this is a, it's a favorite of ARMY. Mm -hmm. And I've heard it myself. Well, it's, we've never had an official reaction on the channel mm -hmm. of On Pun Man. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. leave it to the boys to bring out on BTS Festa 2023. The On Pun Man hey, so, dance practice. So they practice call, report. They, they called me up and they called, and then I called Peter on three way. And Word. so really it was like nine, like nine of us. And they're like, hey, look, for Festa year two for the Amp Theory, we're going to bring out some new stuff. It's old stuff, but it's new to you. But it's new. This was every festa. Last year festa, mm -hmm. they and brought they, out all those dance practices. And they and basically like, oh. said, we want you to react to On Pond Man. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? It's an On Pond Man. Man. But it's a very it's a very popular song in the BTS discography. And How again, I've heard it? it, but we've never done an official reaction to it. Mm -hmm. But once you hear it, you'll be like, oh yeah, I fucking heard this. So join us all week for festa. For, damn, bro, they had their beds in the freaking practice room. It's like, y'all, y'all tired? Take a nap and get back up. Dance <laughs> it's again. Like, I don't know if sleep, necessarily that's Liz training. Like, hey, for real, it's eat, sleep, train. Repeat. Yeah. Like, Repeat. like a dorm. I'm trying to make the transition to... Hey, shout out to my nephew. <laughs> he graduated high school and he's going to North Texas. See him with North Texas uncle. Shout out to my boy, Joey. Because you're smarter than all of us. I'm trying to celebrate, bitch. It's celebration week. You judging me? You're not. I'm not judging you. I won't half I be hard because your finger. I'll never judge you. Wanted to. Why? You judge me with them Kurt Russell eyes. He's judging you. YG is judging you. <laughs> wrong right. guy. Wrong guy. <laughs> wrong band. <laughs> BTS. On Pun Man. The practice record for 2023. Festa. Let's get it. Is there somebody behind him doing this? Yeah, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, yeah. Whoa! I like Yungi with that hair. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Oh, they hit that Harlem shake. That was a cool little step through. My question is, I wonder when these were recorded. Bro, I, I feel like, like, cause last they had year, their name yeah. Yeah. that's what I'm saying. I think, I want to feel like it's like maybe 2015, 2016 range. Cause last year Festo, there were some, you could tell with the hair. They all have dark colored hair here, so it's kind of hard to discern what era that was. Mm. But because you can kind of usually discern, like, okay, I think I does know. R, does RM have his swoop? Mm. Yeah. You know what? What color is Jin's hair? Mm. What color is Sugar's hair? I think it was around the time when we were doing that BU, the one where V jumps the off. Bang yeah, yeah, yeah. where he jumps off the. Maybe that's my guess. You think? That'd be, you think that's it? actually a solid guess. It's it's crazy to me how they hold off on some of these like dance record. Like obviously it's a practice record, so they probably just yeah. like okay, we're obviously either preparing for a tour or mm -hmm. a show, and we're gonna put that. Up. But it, 
the willpower for the big hit to hold off on releasing some of this shit, I think no. that's what steps BTS uh, above the rest. Because obviously every, everybody puts out like, oh, this is a new song we're going to put in all this stuff. But like, they, it makes sense they record all this stuff, but like, anything that they record is going to be gold, I feel like. Nah, it's not, it's not willpower to like hold on to it. It's strategy. How many times is Strategy Peter, and willpower, it's a combination how, how, how of the times, two. How many times has Peter said something like, they're playing chess instead of checkers, right? That's a good point. Exactly. Don't give Peter they're the credit, like, but that's a good point. They're like, hey, you know, 10 years from now, you boys are going to be huge. So, in 10 years from now, let's release these deleted scenes. I don't think this is from 10 years ago. I, I want to say this no, no, is like 2015, but, 2016. But what I'm saying, like, right? Like, but still, just, that was just in that eight era. Years ago. Was like, hey, we see something in you. You have a bright future, kids. We're going to record, and we're going to record a lot. Because when Festa Week comes around in 2023, we need to give the people something new. Makes sense. Yeah. It is crazy, like, just the forethought that comes to it because it like honestly like how many other bands record all this stuff and then like do nothing like yeah. you know because they, they they don't make it as big as bang tang so the fact that they have this is is pretty impressive you know it's very unique because mm-hmm. all the groups that react to it, the, the in just general in k-pop even american groups who the fuck does this mm-hmm. nobody mm-hmm. Uh, nobody mm-hmm. i love it <laughs> I hit that nay nay a little yeah. bit. This is definitely 2016, 2015. basketball move to in there a little bit now we get the fun time live like dance solos I like this choreography I like yeah. it a lot Hey. Yo, okay, so I'm gonna say something that I don't want to tell to take it as disrespect. I'm talking about the people watching. Oh. So, I feel like the person that maybe st- st- stuck out the most, obviously J Hope usually is gonna be the one in dance stuff that sticks out the most. I wanna say though, I think RM stuck out the most in this. My dude, some of his transitions mm-hmm. back into yeah. the group were actually so smooth. It's not, and it's not like, and it's not that like RM's not a good dancer. He is yeah. a good dancer, but it's usually he's not the one that usually sticks out in a group dance practice. But he really yeah. stuck out in this one. For it, me. It's it's funny that it's funny that you say that because like after he did do that smooth transition from uh, from where the glass wall was back to the group, mm. I was just watching how hard like he was like hitting it. Yeah. One thing I enjoyed about this uh, not looking at you dance video. Is that you usually don't see, like with the camera angles, you don't see like when uh, dancers go off camera and they're not supposed mm. to be seen. Yeah. So it's cool to kind of see them like run to the side and then like find their way back in. Mm-hmm. That's pretty interesting. Cause Cause we don't usually see that. Usually these are for stage type performances. Mm-hmm. So they know like, okay, this is the moment I get to run off stage and yeah. it's like solo moment and stuff like that. But we've seen even for fan cams, it's yeah. like when they follow them to the off the stage, yeah. it's like, you know, yeah. but your time, it still has to be impeccable. You have to make sure, oh fuck, I gotta run back in at the right time. But yeah. RM hit the shit out of that. I, yeah. I love that. That's a good ass song too, I'm Yeah. Uh, I think I'm saying it correctly, but 
pretty sure I am. Nah, like, it's, it's a good ass song. And first time I seen the choreography, it was dope. Yeah, no, it was good. Like I said, like I, I do, I hate to do it, but I do have to agree with you because it caught my attention, right? RM stood out. RM, RM stood out, and RM showed out. He did. Yeah. You know what I mean? It seems to me like in K-pop, I, I know uh, they're proud of being able to hit the song like mm -hmm. just like the album, like they sing it almost perfectly, right? Yeah. Um, but I'm really. I'm, I was really digging the auto tune vibe, you know, because it, it, auto tune's a good sound. You yeah, know? yeah. I mean, it's when, if it's used when, properly, yeah, it enhances yeah, in yeah, a good yeah, way. Yeah, yeah. When it's used, when it's used properly and, and not overused, which yeah, obviously right. they all have like fantastic yeah, voices. Right. You don't need to like overdo it. Yeah. So well, that's what I was saying. So. I mean, I mean, but with them you do because auto tune used correctly, you don't notice it. Mm -hmm. So you have very to true. you have to overdo it very, to, very true. to to to. I'm to saying in general, it. like you like. Speaking general, yeah, yeah. yeah. That being said, like, yeah, I mean, since they're always just really hitting the vocals on their own, it's 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 cool to hear that sound because it's the sound is really popular here in America. So. Yeah. Very much, especially so. during this time period. Mm -hmm. Very much so. Hey, we appreciate you stopping by today. Join us all week for more festive reactions. They put out a bunch of dance practices, so you know we'll be back all week with more and more and, and more, more and more and more BTS. I found my hat. Mm. So you're freaking the people out. You did the same thing when you had this fucking hat on. Yeah, but I did it cool. You do it like. Are you, are, look, watch. This is cool. Boys, boys, boys. Hey, thank you for being here. Did you lick me? I did. Join our Patreon, like these other people, and I might, I might like Scott again. Hey, we appreciate you stopping by. You want to watch more Pimple Popper or you want me to lick you? You have only two, those two choices. I'd rather watch Pimple Popper. Bitch, you lying. <laughs> 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 we'll, we'll, we'll catch you on the next one.